It's no secret that the Chinese military is pushing the boundaries of modern warfare with groundbreaking technology. One of their most intriguing projects is the development of an invisibility suit for their soldiers. Recent intelligence reports suggest that the country is tantalizingly close to a breakthrough, one that could completely transform the entire defense industry. Imagine soldiers moving unseen across battlefields, cloaked in suits that render them invisible to the naked eye. However, Western intelligence agencies recently revealed something even more astonishing: China isn't stopping a human soldiers. They're also working on a unique invisibility suit tailored specifically for their robot dogs, designed to make these mechanical canines vanish on a battlefield. This innovative technology could prove to be a game changer in military robotics and tactics. According to sources, the new suit is intended to camouflage these robot dogs from both visual and thermal detection. It employs advanced materials that absorb light and thermal radiation, helping the robots evade infrared and night vision cameras. This capability gives them a significant advantage in reconnaissance missions and operations requiring stealth. Situations where being unseen is as critical as being effective. Robot dogs are already a vital asset in the Chinese armed forces, deployed for tasks like patrolling, reconnaissance, and even demoning. But with this new enhancement, their capabilities could expand dramatically, making them even more formidable tools of war. The secrecy surrounding the development of these invisibility suits leaves experts speculating about how the technology will ultimately be implemented. These suits may not only be limited to robot dogs, but could eventually become standard equipment for other autonomous combat systems as well. If true, this would greatly boost the flexibility and mobility of the Chinese army, allowing them to deploy a wide range of stealth and naval machines across diverse battlefield scenarios. Meanwhile, the U.S. military is actively working to keep pace with these advancements. As part of Operation Hardkill at Fort Drum, the U.S. Army has been integrating robot dogs into its tests to explore the potential of unmanned technologies. They've been experimenting with Vision 60 models from Ghost Robotics, company quadruped robots equipped with sophisticated targeting systems and mounted AR-15 rifles. These machines are designed to counter unmanned aerial vehicles and potential ground threats, offering a versatile response to modern warfare challenges. One of their key features is remote operation, which allows soldiers to control them from a safe distance. This is managed through a specialized tablet that enables the operator to aim using laser and infrared sights. The Vision 60 robots are built to navigate rough terrain, making them invaluable for tasks like reconnaissance, perimeter defense, and supporting combat units. With their maneuverability. They can patrol areas and respond quickly to emerging threats, proving their worth as a dynamic addition to the U.S. arsenal. On the international front, China and Cambodia have once again demonstrated their collaboration through joint military exercises featuring the military robot dogs of the future. During these drills held between the armed forces of China and Cambodia, the People's Liberation Army (PLA). Showcase the capabilities of quadruped robots that look like something straight out of a science fiction film. These robot dogs, mounted with automatic rifles, are designed specifically for urban combat operations. They are capable of identifying targets and engaging them with precision. More than 2,000 troops participated in these joint exercises, which took place at a training camp in Cambodia's central Kampong Chenang province and off the coast of Sihanoukville. The exercises involved 14 warships, two helicopters, and 69 armored vehicles and tanks, with combat, counterterrorism, and rescue operations all put into practice. The main highlight, however, was undoubtedly the robot dogs, quadrupedal machines remotely controlled and equipped with automatic weapons. The Chinese rifle-equipped robot dog is based on the Unitree Go One model, a commercially available platform that ranges in price from $1,800 to $3,000, depending on the version. This model features an ultra-wide lidar sensor, a controller, and even supports large language model AI functions. Weighing around 15 kilograms, its body and limbs are constructed from a combination of aluminum alloy and high-strength plastic. 
It's capable of reaching speeds of up to 3.5 meters per second while carrying a load of up to 8 kilograms, and its battery lasts about 2 hours. Affordable, lightweight, and adaptable, this model serves as a foundation for the military's more advanced applications. Not to be outdone, the U.S. military is striving to match its Chinese counterparts by conducting extensive tests involving powerful weaponry mounted on robot dogs. Recently, the U.S. Marine Corps tested the Unitree Go-1 robot dog, this one equipped with a modified M-72 grenade launcher. The military believes that such robots could prove exceptionally useful in urban combat situations, allowing soldiers to engage the enemy from a safe distance or from behind cover. The weapon system on the robot back includes a mount designed to hold and fire the handheld M-72 grenade launcher, paired with a forward-facing GoPro camera for targeting. In a video released by the military, the launcher attached to the robot fires from a static position supported by sandbags, likely for added stability against recoil and to ensure safety for the testers. What's particularly interesting about this test is that the robot dog carrying the grenade launcher is manufactured by the Chinese company Unitry, highlighting how global technology is intersecting in military applications. Chinese innovation doesn't stop there. The Chinese company Kestrel Defense recently conducted tests of its firearm-equipped robot dog, Dub Bloodwing. This robot is designed explicitly for military use and developed for situations that require strike attacks behind enemy lines. In a demonstration that sparked significant interest online, the robot dog, armed with a firearm mounted on its back, is dropped from a drone and immediately begins providing fire support. With this setup, the drone can deploy the robot in hard-to-reach areas, such as building rooftops or zones where enemy fire positions need to be suppressed. The Bloodwing robot resembles four-legged machines like Boston Dynamics Spot, but is distinctly weaponized to enhance its combat capabilities. According to Kestrel Defense, this robot can be effectively used in tactical operations to create a three-dimensional assault on enemy positions, blending air and ground forces seamlessly. At the International Military Technical Forum, Army 2024, the Russian Kalashnikov company offered a different take on robotic dogs. They presented an impressive show where robot dogs dressed in camouflage performed a synchronized dance. These robotic quadrupeds moved in coordinated formations, showcasing precision and capabilities of modern robotics and hinting at their potential for military applications. The performance captivated the audience, especially as robotic systems are increasingly becoming an integral part of the defense sector. The Army Forum serves not only as a platform to display the latest weaponry, but also to highlight dual-purpose technologies that can be used in both military and civilian fields. In addition to the dancing robot dogs, the Forum featured robotic demoners, rescue stretchers, and other systems designed to ease tasks on the battlefield. Even outside official military circles, the trend of weaponizing robot dogs is gaining traction. An engineer and YouTube blogger from the channel I Did a Thing conducted an experiment where he mounted automatic weaponry on a robot dog from the Chinese company Unitree. Unitree specializes in producing quadruped robots that bear strong resemblance to Boston Dynamics designs. Typically, their models, like the popular Unitree Go One, are used for logistics, patrolling, research tasks, and even entertainment. This experiment, which involved mounting a weapon, highlights potential risks and ethical questions around the use of such technologies. Although the project was created more for attention and as a satirical take on autonomous weaponry, it underscores the possible dangers associated with arming robotic machines. Chinese engineers have long been known for their bold innovations in the robotics industry, and their latest creation is no exception. They've introduced a cutting-edge development in security technology, a police robot capable of independently patrolling streets and pursuing offenders. This robot, designed in the shape of a sphere, is equipped with an artificial intelligence system that enables it to operate completely autonomously. Its primary feature is its ability to reach speeds of up to 35 km per hour and maneuver in various conditions. It can move easily over smooth asphalt and rough terrain and even swim, making it suitable for patrolling diverse areas. 
The police robot is resistant to impacts and falls from heights, allowing it to handle physical challenges during pursuit. Robots of this type open new possibilities for the use of technology in maintaining public order, potentially outperforming any robot dogs in versatility and autonomy. So, which of these robots caught you eye the most? The invisible robot dogs of China, the rifle-toting Vision 60s of the U.S., or perhaps the dancing Kalashnikov bots? Let me know your thoughts. If you enjoyed this dive into the world of military robotics, don't forget to stick around for more. See you next time.